Um, God has been speaking to me a lot this year specifically about uh, just getting more serious with him about, uh, you know, sometimes uh, we go over the same thing over and over in our life. You know, God wants to give us victory in a certain area of our life and we'll just kind of just keep going. I remember uh, in the Old Testament when Moses was leading uh, the people to uh, the promised land at one point God said okay you've traveled around this mountain long enough let's get moving and I feel like God has been saying that in my life in some particular areas and so one of the things he led me to do was uh, take several passages of scripture and put it on uh, little business cards and I carry them with me pretty much everywhere I go and uh, just have them at, at my disposal to um, meditate on um, maybe memorize, but I'm not really working terribly hard to memorize them as much as I am just to, to read them when I have a few free moments. Um, you know, one of them, for example, is Galatians 5, uh, verse 16, really a good bit of that chapter, but a couple of highlights. Um, Paul says, I advise you to live according to your new life in the Holy Spirit. And then he talks about the fruit of the Spirit, he talks about the way the flesh and the Spirit war against each other. And then at the end of the chapter, uh, he says, if we're living by the Holy Spirit, let us follow the Holy Spirit's leading in every part of our life. And what that says to me is, if I'm depending on the Holy Spirit for my very life, um, you know, if, if in other words, this, this new life that he's given me is sustained by the Holy Spirit, I can't take another breath, especially spiritually speaking, without the Holy Spirit giving me that life, then then I need to follow him in all the other areas of my life as well. Um, kind of a slap in the face to the Spirit of God to say I'm relying on you to uh, give me life and to keep me righteous before the Father, but then not rely on him for following him in the daily details of my life. And so that's just one of the things that God's speaking to me about uh, right now, letting the Holy Spirit control all the aspects of my life. Each new day brings